McPhee had to cancel her appearance at the two final shows of her and Foster's tour in Asia. Catherine McPhee and David Foster are supporting each other through a difficult time. After McPhee, 39, shared on Friday that she and Foster, 73, experienced a horrible tragedy in their family, sources tell People the two-year-old son Rennie David's nanny died suddenly. TMZ was first to report the news. The Smash Star initially shared a statement on Instagram about the tragedy to announce that she had to cancel her appearance at the couple's remaining shows of their joint tour in Jakarta, Indonesia, to return home. She wrote, Dearest Jakarta fans, it's with heavy heart I announce I have to miss our final two shows of our Asia run. David and I have had a horrible tragedy in our family and at least one of us needs to get back home to our family. Please know how sorry I am and how much I wish to return one day and perform for you all, the former American Idol alum continued, signing the statement, Love, Catherine. According to Foster's website, the singer-songwriter continued on with the two performances, which were scheduled for Friday and Saturday at Jakarta Central International Convention Center. Many of the singer's friends have already come forward to show their support of the couple. Commenting on McPhee's Instagram post, masked singer Judge Nicole Scherzinger wrote, Sending my love and prayers for your family folded hands medium skin tone red heart. Linda Thompson, who was previously married to DeFoster, also commented, sending you and David love, and hoping that everything is okay folded hands light skin tone purple heart. The talk co-host Amanda Klutz added, sending you loads of love. I'm thinking of you guys. The couple had originally planned to take a three-month break from touring following their concerts in Jakarta before resuming shows in the US in the fall. The tour is currently scheduled to resume on November 1 at the Anyamo Celebrity Showroom in Warren, Michigan on November 1. Foster and McPhee are parents to son Rennie. In October, the pair spoke to people about their son's newfound musical talents. We think he'll be musical, but we don't know, Foster said at the time. Kids, strangely, will do something for a while and then it'll amaze you and then they just drop it and they don't do it anymore. So we don't know if the drumming thing is here to stay, I'd rather he have a tennis racket in his hand than a drumstick to tell you the truth. But anyway, if he ends up being a drummer, that would be great too. He loves watching our drummer, J.R. Robinson.